Good morning, folks. Here we are at the Poly. We are in room 1042, and we would just love to show you around. For DVC, you get the lovely welcome home, and you come into these beautiful rooms at the Poly. And the first time you see this, there's no really getting any better. Hello, and it's the bathroom, and it's like pretty cool. So you got your, you know, your towels, your sink, your soap. You got drawers, room for storage. You got this cool little piece of artwork and a toilet in here. Uh, towels, and you know, of course, the, the usual Disney Resort. H2O for as long as that continues to exist. A shower and a laundry line. Uh, then you move down another sliding door and you say, what? Not possible. Another bathroom? Oh yes it is, because you're at the poly. Hello, a second time. Again, another sink. All the usual amenities. There's a hair dryer in here and a couple drawers. Beautiful stand-up shower. Uh, you know, you got your your wand here, and you've got your uh, your overhead soaker, and there's even a uh, a little bench uh, down here uh, to sit on. So it's really nice. Two showers, so you can really uh, you can really get going. And then as part of the uh, DVC rooms, you get like a little kitchenette too. So you got like your your microwave here, like a, you know, regular size microwave. You have a cupboard full of you know the important things in life paper towel and plastic cups and paper cups and things. Uh, you got a coffee machine, coffee, toaster, sink, can opener, and a pretty cool little fridge. That's, you know, you got your fridge on one side and it actually has a freezer, which is not the standard in all rooms. Uh, and then under here, of course, you got, you know, your garbage and, and that kind of thing. And behind these more fancy, fancy wooden doors, you get all the other things you may need if you're traveling, such as ironing board and iron, a laundry basket, there were some extra blankets and things, and of course, the all important safe. Now, some rooms you get, you know, small safe, uh, like we had a small vertical safe that was on the wall at Universal, but here, it's really big, so we're able to fit, you know, laptops and camera gear and hard drives and passports and things like that in there. So it's really nice. And then, of course, you come into the uh, the room, which is, I guess, what we're what we're here for, right? Isn't that what we're here for? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Welcome. Welcome to the room. So it's a really fancy TV. It's new. Uh, Samsung lets you connect your own devices uh, wirelessly, so you can connect to those. You got this cool little design here underneath, and it's only a design. There's nothing in behind it at all. Heather, you're gonna bread. break it. What? <laughs> oh yeah, it's the world's coolest bed. So I don't think it gets any any cooler than that. If you're a kid, you come here, and all of a sudden your own bed kind of comes out, and uh, you got Lilo and Stitch just kind of you know <laughs> lounging there, hanging out with you. So I think this is the coolest little thing little light switch up there in the corner inside. Very cool. Very well done. So you know that there is a pillow, extra pillow around for this bed. So it does sleep five. You have your extra bed in here. So you just pull off the cushions and then you just pull the bed and you move this table out of the way. Yep. And it just comes down and it's just like a platform bed. Very comfortable. Uh, better than some of the other pull-outs we've seen for oh, sure. It's, it's way, if they can convert all of the pull-out catches in the DVC rooms to this, that would be best time. And cool here for storage as well. I mean, not only do you have a closet, but down here underneath the bed on this side, there's a drawer that goes halfway back. So it's a nice size drawer. And then on this one, there's one that goes back on this side as well. So there's two drawers, but then down underneath, there's actually, it's big enough to fit, you know, two full-size luggage at least underneath. Uh, for your charging stations, you got on either side of the bed here. 
And over here as well. Just under the drawer. Just and then there's charging stations over here. You got a couple of USB plugins here as well. Yeah, so you know, one plug-in, a couple USBs, it's cool little lamp guy. Everybody. In some of the rooms they have this one day book. Um, very cool book. You can, I did see it once in one of the um, resort shops that you can purchase it, yeah. but don't take this if you're staying in one of these rooms. <laughs> it's not for us, yeah. <laughs> it's for everybody. Um, but there's also some storage under this little coffee table. Very efficient. Very efficient. Of course, we're sitting on a ground floor. Which we love. Which we love because you get beautiful, right? So, you know, you get to see all the greenery and it's really nice to sit out here with a coffee or a breakfast and just take in Florida sun. Or... It is. It's nice and quiet down here, actually. Yeah. So, yeah, that's our, that's our little room tour of the Poly yes. 1042. I hope you enjoy. Welcome to 1042 in Maria. Our first day back at Hollywood Studios was trip. Busy which trip. Which is crazy. I mean, we usually would have been here by now. A couple but, times. But anyway, <laughs> that's fine. We're it here is. now. It is. I got to pick up a couple of park maps park and we get a ride surprise. They're awesome, aren't they? Oh. It's a fun ride. So, yeah, if you do get the Skyliner or public transport, when you get off, you're going to come down this way towards the gate down here. So, basically, Tower of Terror over here. Just to the left of it, you'll see the Hollywood sign right here. That's where we're going. As always, the first thing you're going to do is you're going to have to go through security. So yeah, let's see what kind of Christmas is out. What is it, like November 3rd? Uh, so we know Christmas is definitely out at Hollywood Studios. It's Christmas at Disney's Hollywood Studios. Yeah, we do have Christmas. Christmas has popped, hasn't it? Yeah, and I see a tree inside. Mm. Wow. We're going to be doing some vloggy photo, photo vloggies. Studios got those cool things that they do with the lampposts. They're back out. I really love how they put like the Christmas tree up there. As you can tell, the most important part is happening right now. We gotta get that Starbucks coffee first, so let's start with that. Coffee, Tower of Terror. <laughs> Hello, Tower. Hello, Tower. Let's gonna finish our coffee and get a return time for Tower of Terror. As soon as we're done and ready to go, we'll get on the ride and uh, book another one. Super excited. We're all checked into the Grand Floridian, but we don't have a room assigned yet, so we haven't actually been there yet. We just uh, asked for a luggage transfer. They'll text us and let us know. We're all checked in at the Polynesian, which is really sad. We both really love the Poly. It's such a nice, relaxing vibe. It's going to be a bit of a, a shift, a change, but I think it's going to be good too at the same time because we're going to get to explore more of the Grand Floridian. Fantastic. Yeah, Tower Terror went down. So we got us doing a lightning lane right now. We're we'll going in for like five minutes. So we're going to do a rock and roller coaster. As you can see, like that. And then we're popping right here. Best pretzel cart in the park. Uh, it's got like the spicy, spicy cheese. It's the cheddar jalapeno pretzel. That's the word. <laughs> That's what we're looking for. So we got that. Yeah. And then if tower's working good, we still got that experience. That's right. And when we scan in here, we can book our next one. So That's right. Super excited. Thanks for hooking us up with the ride, Thank Bryant. You. Let's so, do it. Yeah. Hi, everybody. We're just on a limo. Yeah. He's got these cool seatbelts. The right <laughs> longest limo I've ever been on. I don't know oh, why. Oh, my God. It's here. been so long since we've ridden this. Yeah, it has. Years and years. Years. Probably 2019, wasn't it? Uh -oh. We need more limos in our life. Here we go! Two, one, here we go! <laughs> 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 the 
Pencil Cart of Glory. See it, Pencil Palooza. Love Pencil Palooza. And this is why, right here. This one. Yeah, it's like Heather's showing you up there. That's the pretzel. This is the cart, Pretzel Palooza. Come get your pretzels. It really is that good. It's worth going in a vlog. Make your way all the way back here. All the way back to Rock and Roller Coaster. Turn it around and Pretzel Palooza right there. And this is what the sucker looks like right here. It's so good. It's filled with cheddar cheese and jalapeno. Yep. So we're going to go find somewhere to sit that's not in the direct sun. Yeah. And if that place existed, everyone would be there. I did pick up a mustard packet. Sounds like yeah. something for a little bit of fun. Yeah. Where's our sauce? There's no sauce. There is. No, there's not. Only if you pay extra. Ah, and you didn't? No, I didn't. Ah. Because it is full of cheese. Cool. And jalapenos. All right, first tastes. I'm gonna have my turn. Heather's gonna grab us some waters. We'll check back in, but make sure you eat all your pretzel. I mean, it just wouldn't be right. All right, we'll see you in a minute. The line will continue to move. However, the wait may be longer than originally stated. We do apologize for the inconvenience. Thank you. At least we're further up in the line this time. Escalator currently stairs. We apologize for the convenience. <laughs> yeah. This, as you may recognize, is a maintenance service elevator. Still in operation, waiting for you. We invite you, if you dare, to step aboard because in tonight's episode, you are the star. And this elevator travels directly to the Twilight Zone. never ridden before and like we actually had to like, we short shared the bar like in front of us like he could hold on I was like it's okay you can hold on with me that's fine and like he even put his hand on my shoulder after it was all done because he was so terrified amazing <laughs> it was amazing his heart rate was up to 135 yeah you can see it on his uh, <laughs> on watch his it was like he had it up just so we can monitor his yeah. own oh heart rate oh my gosh it was so funny he was so, ready to it was go. great it was so tower terror done so we tower still got terror. our anytime experience that took our yep. fast pass out of the queue yeah we'll get to uh, do it again there now yeah so. Yeah, so... When you uh, come out of Tower of Terror, you exit through the gift shop, as per usual. Just kind of like right here. Brings you to a nice little Joffrey's. And more importantly, I think, is like this little space in here. There's so, bathrooms in here. Yeah, there's like generally like just a little bit of space there for uh, some shade, which is always appreciated. And we got a rise return at some point. So for now, we're just going to walk, float, you know. All that good stuff right down the road, see what else we can get into. This is like shopping in here and it's pretty good from kind of this little courtyard right here all the way through, you can walk through. And there's like, uh, you know, some jewelry and things. Very nice, so yeah. Bathrooms, shopping, shopping. DVC, food, 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 food. Ride, ride.
not too bad back in this corner. Most people that come here are here for you know rise of the resistance and things like that. The slinky dog. So they try and get them done early in the morning. Uh, the droids, the lightsabers, all that stuff. So this part of the park is usually slow in the morning, and then as the day goes on, it gets busier and busier and busier. Especially with Fantasmic tonight, it's going to be like that all the way back now tonight. It'll be busy, busy, busy back here. Don't forget Sparkle, so that's your jewelry store. They usually have like, you know, the Disney Pandora stuff. If you're looking for it, you'll find that in there. Other cool rings, we've bought quite a few in there. So if you're looking for something, even if you're not looking for something, it could be worth a stop in to check it out. And the Christmas tree I was looking for is not quite here yet. Not quite. We've started though. So as you'll see, they've got the uh, the Christmas ball, like the ornaments, the decorations kind of like scattered throughout. And here in a little bit, they'll get the tree over there. So it looks like they're approaching readiness for the tree. I'm guessing they're working their way through the parks in some kind of order of preference with uh, Magic Kingdom, of course, being done first. See Indiana Jones sticking out over the treetops. Hey, buddy. The Backlot Express. We've eaten there a couple times now. That don't really impress, but you know, it'll do in a pinch. Um, what are you at? What are you at at? But anyone who wants to race around the galaxy is quite beyond me. But I'm certain you'll have a wonderful flight. Really, really quite lovely if you would like to talk to me. All right, I'm going to put her away. See ya. Galaxy's Edge? Galaxy's Edge. Galaxy's Edge. Yeah. So it's kind of sneaky this one is. I know you've shown me before, but like, you know, we had Star Tours just back here. And as you keep on coming, it looks like there's nothing back here at all. Uh, but there is. You know, Galaxy's Edge should be kind of like written here somewhere or something like that, or welcome to yeah, Batu. Yeah, thing is to do for Harry Potter and Diagon Alley. Yeah. We're having like this like quiet little portal to another world that you don't even know is there. Yeah. Because like with Diagon Alley, you have to go through a brick wall and it's all hidden and that kind of thing. And a lot of people walk right by it, not thinking it is anything. So here, here's the same thing. So look, yep. look, look at this and you'll be in. Make sure you got your credits when you come to Batu. You're going to need some. Uh, they have some different ways you can do it. You can kind of sometimes get these cool little metal gift cards that they have, which are form like a nice souvenir as well. You get your cool little Coke bottles and products and the little round droid looking pods. There's droids to actually build back here, which are pretty pricey. Uh, lots of clothes, cosplay equipment, and of course the lightsaber experience, which is also pricey. Uh, don't forget to pay attention to your exchange rates if you're not from here. Another day older. Uh, just another day older. Happy birthday, Debbie. Thank you. How are you? Now bring down your shields and prepare to be boarded. Don't 
there. They'll want the location of our secret base. Tell them nothing. The future of the resistance is at stake. Two twos. <laughs> Singled out. No. Well, I have all the things that would make me get singled out. <laughs> oh, yeah, we were very serious.
You will tell me the location of the secret base, and then I will destroy you and the resistance. outside the wreck. There, see? I told you it wouldn't be a problem. <laughs> it's all right. Nice job, recruits. Not what you signed on for, but hey, you resist us now. I think I have that authority. Right, Beck? Where's your lieutenant? I need eyes on Beck. I have a I should hope so. Great job, recruits. And your heroism, the location of the resistance base is secure. What? Bravo! Yes, R5, you too. I was like, who am I looking for? Is there a character somewhere? Ah, uh, those helmets are pretty cool. I'd like me one of those. <laughs> you never know. Which one do you like? The big, uh, the big rebel? Yeah. Ah, uh, Dev, get him. <laughs> you won't be straight and straight. Uh, straight. Just for a minute. Just for a minute. <laughs> Makeup on set and action. So we're just checking out our My Disney Experience app. So we're going to see what we can hook into, what we can't. Uh, I'd say we're going to get a water next. Edge about to. If you didn't know, you can come in like this way here from Toy Story Land, or like if you follow this path all the way up and around, that's kind of where you came down past the Muppets. And then from there, you can come all the way down, or you can go up to the right, which brings you down towards the Smuggler's Run. So, rises that way, Smuggler's Run that way, Docking Bay 7 up there. You have lightsaber build in here, you have droid build in here. And this is the back way back to that other kind of Thai ship that's uh, that's back there. Uh, so you can kind of do like a couple of kind of little mini loops uh, within this area. So it can be a little confusing. Lots of great places for characters. Uh, they walk through the Stormtroopers and Kylo. Uh, you'll see Chewie and Rey, uh, depending on. And this kind of like little location right up here. Sometimes they like hanging out up here. And other times they're like hanging out down here. Uh, so if you got your camera, you probably want a pretty big lens if you want something straight. So, as I was saying, I barely turned around, and here you go, Stormtrooper. Squish, 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 squish. Excessive data pad transmission will be monitored. See, it's cool when they come out. It makes it a whole bunch of fun. Adds like a whole level of coolness. Guys, how much 
Pretty good. Had to be faster when we get into speed trouble. Right, pilot. Push the flashing button to take off. Pilot on the left. Move your stick to fly right and left. I was just about to say that. Pilot on the right. Pull back on the stick to fly out and push forward to fly down. Now let's go get that coaxial. Like pilot, make the jump to light speed. score. I don't know. That was awesome. We just did the smugglers run. Uh, six in the vehicle this time instead of four, so I guess everything was working. It's been a while since we had six in the car. We had a good score. I think we we're pirates. Space pirates. So we're at docking bay seven. We're sitting inside. So you're coming through here when you got your mobile order, you kind of stick to the left because the regular line, like the order is along the right. And then you can come back, you can go out over here for more seating, which also leads out to the courtyard, or you can obviously come all the way back here. Virginod hot chicken tippiet. Virginod hot chicken. Which is crispy chicken glazed in a spicy chipotle sauce substituted for the mac and cheese. And got rid of the cilantro. Yeah. Yeah. And we said no on the cilantro. <laughs> We had the spicy chicken, and it was really good. We got some lightning lanes book. So we got a few Toy Story things, but first, the Jack Jack cookie. Our friends haven't had it, and it's a must. So what do you got? I got the Jack Jack Num Num cookie. And that expensive water. And yeah, well, that's free water. Okay, there it is, free. <laughs> Sweet. Something at yeah. Disney is free. Something at Disney is free. It's super cute. It's got like a, you know, polka dots all around and it looks amazing. It sure does. Ooh, look at that. That's oh, wow. a really thick cookie. It is. So, I'm gonna... Oh wow, it looked almost a little crispy. It looks crispy on the outside and then soft in the middle. And it's hot. It's a hot cookie. Okay. Mmm. That was good. Good cookie? What do you think? <laughs> no, they don't like it. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha. 
So, uh, Slinky Dog down, loved it. We had a great time because we got a friend to me and we're riding with friends. So I think that's what it was really meant for. So, that was absolutely awesome. Uh, up next, we're gonna do swirling saucers. So, if you don't know, it's just kind of like you come out of here and you're just gonna kind of head down this way towards Batu. Alien swirling saucers. To get swirled. Yeah, <laughs> this is a rough ride. It I'm is, not, I'm right? Not gonna lie. Sufficiently swirled. Oh, that's Phantasmic, by the way. 45, yeah, it's six. So this here is the line for Phantasmic. So it's six o'clock, the show is not for another two hours, but it is our opening night. And as you can see, wow! So that show is not for another two hours. So we have Two hotel check-ins today, the Grand Flow and the Tower of Terror. Oh yeah! Change the letters. Okay. Take this. And here we go. Hello friends and welcome to Hollywood Tower Hotel. Right now. The rooms are not quite yet ready, so please, we'll look around. Thank you for coming here on your birthday. I hope it's not your last one. <laughs> Let's feel, feel comfortable looking around. There's a lot of books, a lot of antiques. Service elevator. Express elevator. Please do not move until I call your number. You will then find your seats. Fasten your seatbelts from left to right and left to right only. discover what lies beyond the fifth dimension, beyond the deepest, darkest part of your imagination, in the Tower of Terror. Yeah, Jeff was in the roof. <laughs> I looked over and I was like, where is she gone? <laughs> that was fun. Yeah, they put a roof on it for a reason. Just waiting for Mickey Minnie's Runaway Railway to come back up because they went down. No wonder it turned into a multi-experience path. Yeah, she down down. All of these doors were shut, but now we can get on. Yeah, just like that. They are literally just opening them right just now. Them right now. So when it works out, we're getting on. It works out. I love the neon lights. All right, zero, stand by. Save your multi experience. We will use it. We're on a mission tonight, folks. We are theme parking it. We've never done the queue. No, never. And we're gonna run through it like a banshee. Let's take a ride. Oh, <laughs> 
to take a ride on the train? Excuse me, you lady. Who, me? Do you mind helping these good people into the cartoon while I fix this here locomotive? You'll be back in a jiffy to pick you all up. All right, Grandpa, looks like Goofy wants you to head to Cartoon World. Enjoy your train ride. So you can't. No, Slinky's one of the couple. Oh, you can't do Tower of Terror, Rise, Slinky, or Phantasma. Okay. So we could do Rock and Roller Coaster, Smuggler's Run, Indiana, Beauty and the Beast. Well, let's go do Smuggler's Run. Okay. Yeah, so that's what we're going to do. So our anytime experience, or whatever it was called, the... The multi, select multi experience. Yeah. Is, is quite select. Is quite select. <laughs> Beautiful down here at night with the lights. And of course, you know, very Christmassy.
Yes, Chewie will pilot us in. Ripple, you retrieved one container of Covaxia. This will greatly help the resistance. Oh, God, minus what you owe me for damaging the Falcon is... Oh, that is rough. Wait, wait, my friends. I'm afraid we have picked up a hitchhiker. Hello. It's Romania. With Debbie and Jonathan. Hi, I'm Here we go. See you later. Hey, partner. Hey, people here tonight. Um,
good, right? So good. That was amazing. Awesome. Oh, wow. ah, it won. I mean, so good. Fantastic. I guess that's where it comes from. I want to call it fantastic because it was just simply fantastic, but it was actually more than that. It was fantastic. Folks, that ends it from Hollywood Studios. Thanks for coming along. It was a long day. Fantastic. It was a first. Lots of fun with great friends. I don't think it gets any better. And with that, we bid you a good night. But we are at... All right. We already checked in. We know our room number. Just going to pick up our luggage if it's still here. If it's not already in our room. And uh, yeah, we're gonna go to her room and you're gonna get to see it with us for the very first time. Yeah, so we just got off the bus step. Yeah, that's really nice. Cool Cadillac. Carriage. Yeah, so they do have the gingerbread house out. Yeah, Even smells like gingerbread. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in there. Feels like such a beautiful building. Yeah. Unlock the door with your phone. Yeah, it worked. Yeah. Yeah, of course. Interesting. Well, welcome to the Grand Floridian. Yeah. So. You've got your individual showers and bath and body works. This is how I want my house to look. Mm. Look at those Disney mouthwash, Disney cooling gel. Get some money for them. Uh, look at the ceiling. Finished looking at you have robes. Yeah, welcome home. They must be fully loaded. Corkscrew there. Yeah, of course. Here's your fridge. It's just a bar fridge for a lot of DVC members. Like wow, they have a box for the hair dryer. All the fittings and everything, this is like what I want in my house. I mean, look at the ceiling. Look at the Disney magical ceiling. Welcome, Walsh family. No, we don't. This room is gorgeous. I am beyond excited and pleased. So these are the hotel rooms that were converted into DVC studios. So they have like two full size queens and all that kind of stuff. So um, we're gonna crawl into bed and uh, see, have, you tomorrow. <laughs> see you tomorrow because I mean, we're here. It's what a beautiful. night. What a night. Fantasmic. Great day at Hollywood Studios. Great day with Jonathan and Debbie. So thank you for joining us. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow.